Today we'll be talking about the Prita, uh, Buddhism, Thaiism, and Hinduism all tell stories of the Prita's hungry ghosts trapped between death and karmic resignation, cursed to walk the earth with insatiable hunger and thirst. Pritas can be found in stories from several Asian cultures due to the spread of Buddhism, including India, China, Japan, Thailand, and Vietnam. The term Prita does not literally translate to hungry ghost. It is translated from Sanskrit to death person or deceased. The term hungry ghost comes from the Chinese variant Igui. Pritas are usually depicted as emaciated human with swollen bellies and tiny mouths. Their mouths are too small to ever fill their large bellies and therefore they will never be able to satisfy their hunger. They have sunken, mummified skin and narrow limbs. Sometimes they are shown as balls of fire or smoke. Images of Pritas show them licking up spilt water in temples or accompanied by their own personal demons. Pritas exist on the same plane as humans but are invisible to the human eye. Some reports suggest that humans in certain mental states can see them. Pritas wander the desert or wastelands. Their situations depend on their past lives. Some find it painful to swallow any food they find. Some have to watch any food they find burst into flames just as they try to swallow it. And some find their food withers up right before they try to eat it. Pritas are not only constantly hungry, but also deeply affected by temperature. In the heat of summer, Pritas will find even the moon scorching them. In the dead of winter, the sun will freeze them. There are two main types of Pritas, those that travel consecutively and those that travel through space. The later are always scared and have a tendency to inflict pain on others. The former are split into three subtypes. The first suffer from eternal difficulties and suffer from intense thirst, hunger, and temperature insensitivities. The second has internal difficulties where their mouths are too small to fill their large bellies. And the third are covered in creatures that prevent them from eating. There are ways to prevent a relative becoming a Prita. Some religions warn that living a materialistic, greedy life will result in the individual becoming reincarnated as a Prita. And warn against such desire, others say that the correct rituals conducted by the family in the year following death is enough to prevent a spirit from lingering as a Prita. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. That was a Prita. If you guys have any recommendation videos or anything like that, just let me know down below and I will do them for you guys, do my research and all that jazz. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Like I said, it was the Prita. I love y'all. You guys have been killing this channel. I appreciate every single one of you guys and girls. I just want to say thank you and if you haven't hit that like and subscribe button for future videos and make sure you get notified so you never miss out on more videos like this. I love y'all. Stay safe. I will see you in the next video.